Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Jeanne and today I will be showing you guys my car setup. So this, this right here is my back windshield cover, but it, the Velcro keeps coming off, so I have to figure something out to fix that. But as you can see, we just have this flat bed. It's two different pieces of plywood and you can check out my, um, the car setup build like my simple car build for under 60 it was a pretty cheap car build it was like 65 dollars and that's with all my mess ups so you guys can check out that to get what i did for this board and thing so as you can see i have a blanket in here we've got a um a little sleeping pad that you can pump manually and we have a blanket over the plywood and this is a very simple build you just lift this up, it's just plywood, and there's like a little organization storage space. And we have a yoga mat, some things I want to do when I'm creative, when I feel like feeling creative and I'm maybe bored, draw or paint or something like that. Then we have all of my cooking supplies. I have a table, a, a little chair, a basket, and then some cookery ware stuff. I've got a blender, a portable gas stove, a little crock pot thing thingy and then all my utensils in there i think i'm gonna store like extra clothes in here and more things i'm just not that sure of yet i have this tote for whenever i go to like the gym to shower or something and i also have this but i'm i don't know what it is so i need to figure that out yeah so i've got a lot of stuff in here and then i've got my fan for whenever it's hot which is battery operated and it fits right good in this little slot. All right, guys, so on this side, as you can see, we've got my sleeping pad. This is where I'm gonna be sleeping at. And we've got my dresser, which I made from plywood and wood glue. I just took a little jigsaw, cut the plywood, took my finger. It was very messy, but you know, we got the job done. I'm not a professional by any means, so I did what was easiest for me. Um, we've got my dresser, which has got books, and I've got bathing suits and pajamas. Then we've got a few like pants that I will wear for hiking and then um, yoga pants. Then we've got shorts and skirts. I got underwear and socks. And then I've got little shirts that I'll wear either for pajamas or just everyday wear, hiking, all that stuff. Then on this side is where I'll be keeping my food. And so this is gonna be like my little refrigerator pantry type thing. I wasn't sure if I was going to put ice in this little compartment it goes up like this and then but i primarily will be eating plant-based and so i would just have brown rice and pasta and stuff like that and then canned beans for the most part and on this side as you can see i have shoes down here this is where my shoes will be got hiking shoes this is my walking shoes they're very comfortable then i've got some shower shoes just some flip-flops that my aunt gave me they're gonna be my shower shoes this side isn't that exciting there's nothing really but some shoes and the back of the dresser all right so in my front seat i just got some hand sanitizer some lotion a hair tie a pocket knife I am using two different windshade covers to cover my windshield so that nobody can see in. One I bought at Amazon, one I got at a garage sale for free. And that's about it in my front seat. Got my amazing steering wheel cover and a nice foam pad that my father gave to me. All right, so on the passenger side, we've got this pretty big knife that my father also gave to me in case somebody wants to come try it. I will probably be taking this on hikes um, or something. I need to get some bear spray just in case, but I will look up the animals in the local regions that I'm in so that I can be prepared because I don't want to get mauled by a bear or a mountain lion or a bobcat and that, so. We've got hand sanitizer because we gotta stay clean. This is gonna be one of my water spouts. Uh, I forgot to put the other one in here. Both of these are gonna be my portable toilets. If you watched um, my thrift haul, you'll see all the stuff that I got that's in my car that is from 
a garage sale or a yard sale that didn't cost much money but it's going to be very valuable for my experience i've just got this little car tripod that i have to take down in order to put my windshades up and this is going to be where all my toiletries go in the front seat so that they're just always accessible so this right here is my hair bag i plan to take my first solo trip this weekend so yes i am preparing my car and this is the car tour i want to get more into well my skincare right now i use curology and i'm pretty sure that is not like natural so if i was to wash my face and then like pour the the soap soapy water off into the grass like that would cause runoff of chemicals and i don't want to do that so i'm trying to figure out how all that will work for me as of right now i'm trying to figure that out but i will learn more about it as i continue to as i continue this journey more things will be knowledge in my glove compartment i've got some wipes some masks plastic straws and then car information and more wipes Ooh, and a first first aid kit which is great because i didn't think i had one of these but now i do now i know i do so yeah place to roll them up which is fine because window covers shades whatever you want to call them uh, they actually do a very good job I will link the video below where I found the method to do these because they they like really reflect the Sun like my car stays really cool it's like heaven like I was like what but anyway yeah so that is my car tour thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed hopefully this inspired you i really took inspiration from a lot of different videos and combined it into one i just did whatever fit my needs and how my car is because the type of car that i have is fairly new and a lot of people don't really have it so i just i know i have a smaller car it's basically like a prius but the hyundai version so you know I just did what worked for me and this is that so hopefully you guys enjoyed hopefully you got some inspiration and i'll see you guys in the next video